guy did a video saying something about Tan Sao, and he said against the hook punch it won't work, but he was facing this way. See, that's not gonna stop it. So when you do Silong Tao, your Silong Tao is in your center line, so you have to face the point of contact. So my body's behind it. So then I'm hitting this way. This way, you're gonna get me. And also people think we use the hand, push through, you'd smash me. You use this part here of the forearm. So, and also he said, throw a round punch at me. See what I'm doing? I'm not, um, I'm just doing this. I'm spreading like spreading butter. Do it on that side, round punch. See? But you're not gonna leave your hand there, right? You're gonna pull your hand back so I don't do something else. So do the round punch, see? Do it harder. Come on, harder. He's a big, strong Marine. But he said you can't stop that with a hard punch. Throw it hard. <laughs> see, what, see what happens? Yeah. I mean, because I'm not taking the brunt of the force. So he did a demonstration with him standing here and a guy pushing, saying you can't, of course if I stood there, I'm not gonna stand there, a fight is dynamic, you know? But they don't understand. And if you did a round kick to my head, right? I wanna hide, well say you, say you'd say this was a round kick. Give me your arm, oh, round kick. I'm doing a, a Quan Sao up here, do it on that side. I'm doing the Quan up here, you're kicking to my head. I don't get it, all these guys focus on everything down here. What do they do to cover their heads? I don't see that. And when I studied uh, kickboxing from Yoel Judah and Mark Greeland, they used to teach me to do a jab and grab my ear roll. Cross, grab my ear roll. They used to tell me to keep my hands up because I was doing the other Wing Chun and everything I had, my guard was down here. Tan Sao here, Fuk Sao here. But when we do it high, they say it's wrong. But I don't want to get hit in the face, so I guess I'll be wrong then. Thank you.